we I've got a good day in store because we are gonna go up giant mountain it's about 4200 meters above sea level at the, uh, the peak there starts kind of off in a uh, gorge and then we walk along a stream we recross it a few times and uh, it's one of the sacred mountains around the area and it's gonna have some stunning views of the valley on the other side of town as well as the town itself there's a series of peaks actually uh, I don't know how far we're gonna get how many peaks we're gonna do but it's gonna be an epic day you're gonna want to stick around for this one right high five all right there's the entrance to the temple but we're not actually going to the temple we are headed right there that's where we're going Ooh, it's gonna be a long one let's take a minute and thank our sponsor jeremy from wild west riders slash bike he takes people all around on biking tours hiking tours van tours or just custom tours all around southwest china he really knows the country he knows his stuff. He is the person to go to if you like this type of thing. This is the first trip that I've joined Jeremy on and it's definitely not going to be the last. You will see more hiking trips from me with him for sure sometime in the future. That being said, let's continue on with the video. Thanks a lot, Jeremy. I will be seeing you again soon. Actually, this right here is a school. Students here, they study Buddhism. It's called Fo Shui in Chinese. So, a lot of kids. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't expect to see like kids and monks here, or kids in uh, the monk garb, I suppose. Yeah. So it's not that difficult of a trail. Basically, we're gonna follow this river, uh, this creek, until we get to the source. It says there'll be like a pile of stones, and then there's water coming out of it. That's where the spring comes from. So we're gonna go up there, and we're gonna hit a couple more valleys, or a couple more like green spots, and then head up. It's like a couple more hours. Ooh, that was, that was kind of tricky. These all move. Oh, all of these are moving. Boy. Good luck, fellas. <laughs> Look at them like little ants. Three, two, one. Oh, hey, he made it. <laughs> Not so bad. Not so bad. God, it just gets more and more beautiful. Man. Here's the source, no joke. Come from right here. Can't say I've ever seen like a river source before. Look at how clear that water is as well. Yeah, doesn't get any fresher than that. Ain't that right?
And here's lunch. <laughs> Don't worry, we're taking our trash with us. Mike's gonna finally have his yeah, this yak's getting awfully time. close. He's it's it's smelling our oh, it's smelling our lunch. <laughs> oh boy. Get along, move along. Nothing to see here. It's getting a little more obvious where to go. Yeah. Looking good, looking good. I look way up there. Do you see the sheep? There's tons of them. That's where we're going. Yeah, now is the part of the journey where we're basically just following sheep trails. Just going up and up and up to there. When does it get dark? 8 or 8.30? Yeah. And that's our stopping place for a second. Mm. Oh, that's good. We left at 11, and it's getting to be about 4.30, nearly 5. And this is the part where it gets really tough. 3,900 meters or so, almost 4,000. Getting there, you're really feeling the altitude. And this is the part where I stop filming. I take off my backpack, I leave it on the side of the mountain, and I just go up. Because I can't do it. All of us were feeling it. We were all pretty tired, but it was so close. So close. Hey, we've done the hard bit. We're about on level with uh, these peaks right here. Now all we have to do is just go kind of right there to the ridge and decide which one we want to go to. Boy. Ah, man. Ah, oh, we made it to the top. You're sucking air. You're zombified. We've made it to the top. Why this would be a sacred mountain, right? I think the peak that we were originally heading for is right there. But as you can see, or maybe you can't, I can't I can't see the viewfinder. The day's too bright. But yeah, it's still a ways. It's five o'clock pretty much. So if we want to make it before dark, we gotta uh, we gotta hustle. So that there actually is the mountain we're supposed to go to. That's the sacred mountain. Jeez, that's still a few kilometers away. There's no way we could get to that. Like, we started this hike at, like, um, like we started at 11, and it's 5. I don't know how, I don't know what the itinerary is. That place is going to be. <sighs> absolutely crazy. That's absolutely crazy. This is epic enough. It's like night and day. It's sunny up here and it's dark down there. And it looks like rain clouds as well. This is the mountain we want to be on because this is actually just connects a whole bunch of different peaks and you can see everything it's insane as far as like most tired i've ever been this is definitely in the top three i think but man it's so worth it
what an amazing hike. What a crazy, epic adventure that was. That might have been the best hike I've ever been on in terms of the views, the changing scenery, and just being alone. After a, about an hour on the hike, there was nobody else joining us. It was just serene, tranquil landscapes. But we had to hustle down. It took us six hours to get there and we had to get back in maybe three hours, summiting at about five o'clock and getting back to town at about eight. We booked it down, but we did talk to some of the local wildlife. Excuse us, we would like to go home, please. Can you move? We'd appreciate that. Thank you. Much obliged. Hey, there we go. Ah. The other ones are red, these are blue. We got back to the school that I showed you earlier right as the sun disappeared. It was dark right as we got back to town. It was planned perfectly. What an experience, what an experience. Yeah, if this seems like something you'd be interested in, please contact Jeremy in the pinned comment and in the description. And yeah, if you like this kind of content, give the video a like and check out channel memberships or my Patreon. That'll also be down below. I'd love it if you could support the channel. But yeah, that's, uh, that's about it. Thank you all very much for watching and I'll see you all next time from Mount Mahakal.